Big development from today's hearing. Martinez Hernandez's trial is being postponed until April. And WJZ on your corner in Hartford County now. Tara Lynch was inside that courtroom and explains why it is being pushed back several months now. Rachel Morn's mother, Patty, sat front row as Victor Antonio Martinez Hernandez appeared in Hartford County Circuit Court. She welled with emotion, seeing the man accused of killing her daughter for the first time in person. The trial was set to begin later this month, but has since been postponed to allow the defense more time to review the evidence. To be in the same room with the man who's alleged to have killed your daughter, it's, it's just a very emotional day. In his first in-person court appearance, Victor Antonio Martinez Hernandez remained shackled by his feet and ankles with several armed Harford County Sheriff's deputies standing around him. This was the first time Rachel Morin's mother, Patty, saw her daughter's alleged killer in person. Martinez Hernandez is charged with the murder, rape, and kidnapping of Rachel Morin, the Maryland mother of five who was found beaten and raped along the Mon Pa Trail in August of 2023. To see him on TV when we had the bear review hearing across the street was so different than when you have him in the room. He's, he's, his hands are shackled, his legs are shackled, he's wearing the striped black and white jumpsuit. The scheduled motions hearing changed to a trial postponement hearing. The public defender's office representing Hernandez asked for the trial to be postponed from the end of this month to next spring, saying it has a voluminous amount of evidence to review. You're looking at 10 months of evidence. The state has had this since the day Rachel was found and they've been collecting evidence. The defense is now three months and three days or four days into this, so they've got a lot of catch up to do. The alleged killer waived his right to a speedy trial and a waiver of conflict of interest with the public defender's office because of its prior representation of Morin's boyfriend, Richard Tobin. After a nationwide search, Martinez Hernandez was arrested at a bar in Tulsa, Oklahoma in June. He was then brought back to Maryland to face the charges. Hernandez is from El Salvador and only speaks Spanish. He communicated through an interpreter explaining he's under psychological care at the detention center and completed school through the seventh grade. Around December 1st, we're going to become grandparents. Matthew McMahon is the father of Morin's eldest daughter. He was also in court today. Rachel just didn't deserve this. Um, we shouldn't have to be here. Um, but at the end of the day, it's a good day because this is a day for justice for Rachel. Attorneys will meet for a few pre-trial hearings. According to the judge, the trial now set to begin April 1st, 2025. For now, reporting in Harford County, Tara Lynch, WJZ.